Would the police and the paramedics put in their reports that there was a witness to the drowning who didn't save the child because, unfortunately, the witness was depressed at the time? No, that's not what happens. You know it, and I know it. We do have the power to set any emotion aside if there's an emergency or a bigger game to play. And that game is ours to imagine. In relationships, there are givers and there are takers. Each one is a personal invention, and each one gets a different result. The givers have fun, and the takers are usually paranoid about being exposed as takers and losing the relationship. When I'm working with salespeople, I notice that the ones who struggle the most are seeing themselves as takers. They call for an appointment and apologize for taking someone's time on the phone. Then they ask if they could take more time in person to demonstrate the product. At the demonstration, they soon get around to asking if they can take some of the customer's money. It's a life of taking, so it's small and miserable. There's nothing more depressing in relationships than feeling like you're taking more than the other person is from the relationship.